So we went to the New York Stock Exchange and um, we get stuck in traffic and it's really not traffic because what they do, there's a high security in Wall Street. They stop every car in an empty space and they bring out big dogs and they sniff everything and they check the car, check below the car. Um, we were waiting in the car for about like 20 minutes and I thought that we were going to miss the bell and that would have just been terrible. We can't be late because we have to ring the bell at 4 o'clock. Well, technically 3.59 and 45 seconds. So we jumped out of the car in our nice high heels and whoop, walked down two blocks. I was just trying my best not to fall on my face and my heels because the cobblestones and heels don't work together very well. Big nerd, I watch the New York Stock Exchange um, and I used to always have the Bloomberg channel in my office when I used to work at Detroit Medical Center. And um, every day at four o'clock, I'm interested in watching to see not only how the stocks are doing, but who's ringing the bell. <laughs> Thank you. Lots of fans. This is Vic. So my brother-in-law is uh, with Goldman Sachs. So uh, he's like, I'm watching you. That's Goldman Sachs right here. Goldman Sachs. Woo! Thank you. But when I got up on the balcony, I didn't realize how many people were actually watching. So um, I guess I wasn't as nervous as I would have been if I was thinking millions and millions and millions of people are watching me right now. My mom has been asking me almost every week, so what are you doing this week? Are you going to the New York Stock Exchange? I'm like, mom, what makes you think they're gonna invite Miss USA to ring the bell? And they did! So, mom, you got your wish. Um, I graduated with an economics and business management degree, so for me, this is like heaven. <laughs> How often do you get to come to the Stock Exchange? It's just. It's a thrill, definitely.